can fake it in a lot of aspects of the world, but you can't fake what gets you in the right mood to fight. You can't fake it in the ring. You can fake it by looking the part and doing a whole bunch of weights or wearing really cool shorts and having cool tracksuits and everything. But once you're on that way out, once you're walking out on that uh, on that walkway towards your fight, you can't pretend to be something you're not. Music, you know, makes my memory go back to, you know, if I listen to Eminem songs, I remember when I first started fighting, it really meant a lot to me and, uh, you know, The Offspring, you know, it meant more to me back then because it was, well, I was angry, but now I'm not so angry, so I like something happening. <laughs> Uh, I remember last fight listening to Tupac in the um, uh, and NWA in the rooms. We all knew the lyrics, we were all singing, and that sort of got me pumped and we were all just laughing, singing, and mucking around in our own little change room. And then um, we both fought that night and both won. So uh, it makes a huge difference. You know, so many guys come out to high energy dance music or real heavy metal or gangster rap. You know, Steve makes himself different by being who he is. And he's scared to be an individual, he's not scared to be who he is and that'll make him stand out. In the end that's going to make him more popular and uh, more famous and that brings more money and more shots and titles and that's what the whole thing, that's the whole game of being a fighter.